watch this documentary on the History Channel. That's probably be interesting on it. The guy wrote and says, we haven't discovered the rest of the ocean. There's more intelligent life there. And my first response is, duh. We have to swim to see fishes. That's how I'm doing a, a commentary on this, um, <clears throat> on this ancient aliens. But you don't get it. Fishes are lazy because we have to swim to them. Meaning, they don't have to know that we have to go. We're man, on the other hand, we have to swim to see these animals. We have to travel to see these animals. So, it shows you who's more lazy. The animals who decide to sit down and rest, or the humans who <laughs> don't lie at rest and get to know. <laughs> Damn, speaking of fighting with each other. <laughs> I'm sorry, think about this. If I want to see a wild lion, I have to go find it and wait. The line is like, what's a human doing? I don't know. It's the first time humans with the cameras again. God damn it, we got post exam things? Uh, I can't do the, do the lion thing. Don't show them what we actually do. Let's see how long it stays. If we get too close to one, we're, we're, we're not them. Let's, let's see. Let's see. We, got, we got distance to it. Don't put force on mine. That's how tigers be. And look at my cousin swooping underneath their neck, man. That's actually me. I got your car and he over here getting cussed by recipe by that damn maid. Those two men right there, those two were knobs. Those were those were the two people. Oh, how you doing? Your knobs were one of them. Went to go have a little hanky panky with um um Mrs. Um the one who won Maxwell. Yeah. They have a kid together, huh? Well like they signed up together. Hell no. A gay man, and she's a gay woman. Get <laughs> 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 your stories about they do now. Oh, Jesus, forgive me. <laughs>